Hello, music fans. Barnaby Marshall here with another edition of the Rock Peaks Vlog. This week on the show, we've got Dave Grohl, Paul McCartney, Sting, Lyle Lovett, and the great Jerry Garcia. So stick around for the next four minutes or so and let us entertain you. Coming up this week, the big event we're all waiting for, of course, is Arcade Fire's sold-out show at Madison Square Garden on Thursday, which is being webcast on YouTube starting at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You know, it's great that in a summer where concert attendance is uh, relatively flat, bands are trying some of these new, creative, uh, inexpensive ways of connecting their fans to their music. Arcade Fire's new album, The Suburbs, is out this week, and Terry Gilliam is directing the webcast, the former Monty Python alum. Should be an interesting show. We'll have a full report for you next week on the vlog. The ever-eccentric, unclassifiable, and former Mr. Julia Roberts, Lyle Lovett, turned up on The Tonight Show last week and laid down Jesse Winchester's comic gospel, Isn't That So?, taken from Jesse's album, Third Down and 110 to Go. Want the thing to grow, but isn't that so? It's good to see that even in these rocky economic times, Lyle's still sporting his extremely large band. 16 players on stage for this old cover tune. Proving once again why he'll be at the top of the guest list at the door to Musician's Heaven. Paul, you're definitely my hero. Mr. President, you're my other hero. <laughs> on disc this week, we were fortunate enough to get our hands on a fan-made DVD of the recent Paul McCartney appearance at the White House. Now, if you missed this broadcast on PBS, you may want to seek out this torrent, if for no other reason than to watch Dave Grohl of the Foo Fighters perform a blistering version of the old Wings chestnut, Band on the Run. For more details and to read a terrific review of this performance, visit rockpeaks.com. Another man with a very large band behind him, Sting is out on tour this summer with the Royal Philharmonic Orchestra. Now, I know what you're probably thinking. You're thinking Sting plus orchestra equals pretentious wanker. But uh, have a look at this next clip from the Red Rocks Amphitheater early in the tour. We were, we were kind of impressed with what we saw. Judge for yourself. find out what songs Sting's playing on this tour and when he might be playing in your city, check out our complete Sting tour kit on rockpeaks.com. Finally this week, one from the vaults. It was 15 years ago this week that we lost one of the greats, Jerry Garcia. We've been uh, digging around the Rock Peaks archives and we've come up with this, what we feel is the best Jerry solo ever recorded on film. <laughs> Jerry's interpreting Otis Redding's Hard to Handle, just a few short years after it was first heard by anyone. And he's taking the, the soul of this soul song on a, on a crisp jazz rock fusion joyride. We're, we're coming in right at the climax of a three minute solo. The band is totally locked in and he's bringing the song's orbit back to a smooth blues landing. Pretty sweet stuff. We miss you, Jerry. Until next time on Rock Peaks, I'm Barnaby Marshall.